Noel Willman was born in Derry City on the August 4, 1918. He was the son of a Strand Road hairdresser and a former chorister in the St. Columns Cathedral. He won acclaim on both sides of the Atlantic, both for his stage and screen performances, but especially for his skill in stage directing. His first worldwide recognition came in 1961 when he directed Paul Schofield in Robert Bolt's A Man for All Seasons at the London's Globe Theatre. The following year, the production moved to New York, where it won William a coveted Tony Award. He appeared regularly in a number of horror films and many war films, usually part of playing a Nazi. The stars turned out to pay a final homage to him on December the 14th, 1988, at a memorial service in New York. His great friends, Catherine Hepburn and Gene Simmons, were among those at his graveside who'd mourned his passing. This starry teenager, back in 1937, went in search of Hollywood fame and in true tradition found it. Today this Ulsterman is forgotten about it. While thousands of us have enjoyed his films over the years, yet not realizing he had the roots on the banks of the foil. Locked in this ornate coffin. Oh, but it's beautiful here. It often happens in life that the most beautiful things are made from the most unpromising of materials, don't you find? That wine we enjoyed at dinner, you did enjoy it, I hope. It was delicious. Made from grapes trampled by the feet of a peasant. Dirty feet, as like as not. Father. Well, it's true, isn't it? That pheasant we ate, it had been hanging for five... Oh, father, please. 